and every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ, Christ is Lord. She will Raising from the dead, you are Lord. Every knee shall bow, and every tongue shall confess. Oh, thank you, Jesus. We thank you, my God. We thank you, Lord of Lord. We thank you, King of Kings. We bless your holy name for another day. We thank you for another night. We thank you all oh, for another blissful morning. Oh, Father, we bless you. We magnify you. We lift you. We honor you. Oh, Rock of Ages, Ancient of Days, the I am that I am. Oh, the I am that I am. <laughs> We thank you, Jesus. We thank you, Jesus. Oh, we thank you, King of Kings, Lord of Lords. We magnify you. We lift you. We exalt you because you deserve it. We exalt you because you deserve it. Oh, the keeper of our soul, our provider, our redeemer, our healer, our deliverer. Father, we bless you at this moment. We lift you, we lift you, we lift you. We magnify your name. We magnify your name. We magnify your name. We thank you, Father. We, we thank you. We thank you tonight for another day. We thank you this morning for another day. We thank you this afternoon. We lift your name on high. We bless you because you deserve it. We bless you not because, Father, not because of what we have, but because of your protection upon our life. We bless you because you've made all the agenda of the devil, all the plans of the enemy. Father, you've made it useless. That is why we are giving you thanks. Father, we are giving you thanks because you've done so many things in our life and you are about to do so many things in our life. We bless your holy name. Father, we receive power from above. Tonight, Father, use me as a vessel. Tonight, use me to speak to your children. Oh, Father, let me be the mouthpiece of you tonight. Don't let me speak of my own, my own mind, but let me speak of your counsel to your people tonight. Father, in the name of Jesus, I bind principalities. I bind powers. Oh, I bind powers. I bind principalities. Wherever the facile agent of the devil to come and cause interruption, release your tender and release your fire on them. Wherever they've guarded, oh, all because of tonight's program. Father, let your fire scatter them on their way coming. Wherever they facile giant, they facile devil, they facile messengers, they facile, oh my God, to come and cause interruption in tonight's program. Holy Spirit, destroy them. We take dominion, we take authority over thrones, over nations, oh, over kingdoms in the name of Jesus. And we establish your purpose, my God. We establish your purpose, my God. We take dominion, oh my God. We take authority, my God. We take dominion, we take authority over the prince of Persia, over the prince of Persia, over the queen in the coast. Father, we release your weapons. We assign your angels tonight to be on straight assignment in the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Ghost. I lift every soul that will enter tonight's program, that will log into tonight's program into your hand. Holy Spirit, by the cross of tonight's program, change the destiny of your children because I know you are the destiny changer of God. You are the destiny changer. You are the record breaker in the life of your children. By the cross of tonight's program, Father, in the name of Jesus, manifest yourself in the life of your children. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Hallelujah. You are all welcome. Happy new months to you all. 
Happy new month to you all. As usual, you do it well to share and the Lord will bless you. Share and invite somebody. Share and invite somebody. Share to groups. Share on Messenger. Share on WhatsApp. Everywhere that you can share. Those in the global platform, WhatsApp. Global platform, WhatsApp. Do it well to share. Do it well to share on WhatsApp for them. Do it well to share on WhatsApp for them. Because many of them, their time have changed. Yes, their time have changed. Do it to share and the Lord will bless you. Hallelujah. I bring you greetings from the Lord Jesus Christ. Jesus loves you so much. Jesus loves you so much. I bring you heavenly greetings from above. Heavenly greetings from the Father who doesn't discriminate. From the Father who doesn't care about the number of times that you've sinned. From the Father who doesn't even care about your iniquity. Who cares about redeeming your soul, ransoming your soul, delivering your soul? I bring you greetings from our Lord Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. 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 Jesus loves you. God bless you so much. God bless you so much. As usual, let me take you through just 15 minutes um teachings in the bible so that we, as we keep waiting for them to join uh, yes let's study something in the word of god who is the greatest who is the greatest it's a great question that the, the disciples of jesus went to him to ask him they went to him to ask him who who among us is the greatest who among us is the greatest so we also how can we be great in the kingdom of god who is a great person when we come to the sight of God, is it the worthy man? Is it the worthy person? Is it the person that rides in a limousine? Is it the person that has a better husband or a better wife? Who is a great? Who is the greatest? Who is the greatest? When we talk to in the sight of God, how can we even attain that favor to become a great person in the sight of God? Hallelujah. Take your Bible and let's quickly go to the book of uh, Matthew chapter 18 verses number 1 to 4. Take your Bible as we read together and as we study just 20 minutes, as you keep sharing and inviting them, you keep sharing and inviting them and you take your Bible and you open to the book of Matthew chapter number 18 verse 1 to 4 say at that time the disciples came up and asked Jesus who then is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven who then is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven they were waiting for Jesus to say oh it is Peter oh it is this oh it is John oh it is the but Jesus didn't choose any of them Jesus Christ didn't choose any of the disciples to say you are the greatest, but rather let's hear verses number verses number two say and Jesus called a little child to himself and put him in the midst of them, and he said and said truly I said to you unless you repent and become like little children. You can never enter the kingdom of heaven. So before you become, you turn, you have to turn to be like a child. You have to be like a child before you can make to heaven. Before you be recognized as one of the greatest people on earth. In the sight of God, if you are not being recognized as one of the greatest, it will be very difficult for you to make to heaven. Yes. When you are bigger than your master, you can't pass through the narrow gates. When you are bigger than your master, when you feel so proud, arrogant, more than your master, I tell you, it is difficult for you to go through the narrow gates. And we have two gates. We have the narrow gates and the broad way, the narrow way and the broad way. So if you, until you turn to be like a child, you change, you repent to be like a child, you can never go through the kingdom of heaven. That is the narrow gate. Hallelujah. Let's see three qualities or four qualities because of our time. We will just take three qualities of the children. What makes them so, so, so precious in the sight of God? When I took a child today, when I was preparing, when I was thinking about this message, I just focused on one of our, our grandchildren in the house, the granny of my madam. I was just looking at the child. 
And I learned three things from that child. And I want to distribute to your heart right now before we start praying. We are here to pray, but I just want to fill your heart. with. I just want to feed your soul with the word of God. Because the food for your soul is not, it's not a bath. It is not rice and stew. It is not rice and soup, but it is the word of God. Without the word of God, your, 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 your spirit being is weak. It's weak. Hallelujah. Three things that I saw about children. Children, one, they are trusting. Trusting. Two, they are lowly. Three, they are loving. Four, they are forgiving. Qualities. Qualifications. Qualities that you can, we can derive from children. Take your child in the home and let's make this a critical example. Your daughter or your, your toddler at home. You can see anytime that you offend or you wrong the child, it doesn't matter the number of times that you beat them. When you open your arm, they come back to you again. First of all, it's trusting. Children trust their parents. Even when you are lying to them, they trust it. When you are telling him, oh, I will buy this for you. He know you will not buy, but still the child trusts you. Yes, this is what Jesus wants us to do as children of God. Because he has given us power to be called out. Children of God, according to the book of John chapter 1, verses number 12. He said, anyone that believed in him, he has given us power to be called out. Children of God. So every child must trust his father. Trust Jesus. Let's go quickly to the Bible, the book of Proverbs, chapter number 3, verses 5 to 6. Take your Bible. Take your Bible for me. If you don't have Bible, use your Bible up on your phone. I want you to read so that when you go home, you can meditate on the word again. Yes, the book of Proverbs, chapter number 3, verses 5 to 6. Say, trust in the Lord with all your heart and do not lean on your own understanding. You have to be, you have to have a child, the character of a child, by trusting your father in everything. Do not lean on your own understanding. Do not be wise on your own. Everything, keep trusting in the Lord. Keep trusting in, in the Lord. Verses number say, say, in all your ways, acknowledge him and he will make straight your path. When you keep your trust in God and you start acknowledging him, you start cherishing him, you start admiring everything that he's doing for you. He's going to straighten your path. He's going to direct you. He's going to make, yes, I'll pray for your baby boy. Wait, you start praying very soon. You start praying very soon. Yes. If you start acknowledging God, if you start putting your trust in God, he will make your way straight. Yes, I studied about the prophet Jeremiah, the, Jared, the, the prophet that was called when he was a baby boy. He was ordained as a prophet in the womb of his mother. Before he was formed, God said, I have ordained you. Jeremiah is speaking in the book of Jeremiah chapter 17 verses 5. He said, blessed is the man who trusts in the Lord. So before you be counted as one of the blessed in the sight of God, you have to trust God. Trust God. Children trust their parents with all their heart. Trust God in everything. Trust God and let God also trust you. Yes. You trust God and God will also trust you. Hallelujah. That is the first thing I saw about children. They trust. They trust. They trust. They trust their parents. When you, you, you call your daughter and say, oh, come, I want to take you to the mall. I am going here. The daughter, you see, your toddler doesn't think about, oh, this man is going to kill me. This man is going to rape me. This man is going to do this. He's going to, he doesn't think. He trusts. And they obey as you, you tell. They trust and they obey. So we have to learn that, that from children. Before we can go through the narrow gate, we have to trust God. Hallelujah. The second thing I learned about children, children, is they have a forgiving heart. They forgive easily. Peter, the apostle, <laughs> asked Jesus, how many times? Should we forgive when our, our brother or our sister offend us? How many times should I forgive? He was thinking Jesus will say, oh, three times. But Jesus didn't say that. He said 77 times 7. 
It doesn't matter the number of times that you beat your daughter, you beat your son. As soon as you, you, you open your hands, he will come to you. They forgive easily. They easily forgive. It doesn't matter the number of times that you've offended them. Your daughter will come to you. He will run to you as soon as you stretch forth your hand. Yes. We have to learn this and live in peace with one another. Learn to forgive ourselves. Learn to forgive one another. Because if we don't forgive, it is difficult for God to forgive us our trespasses. If we are not able to forgive people that wrong us, that offend us, it is difficult for God to forgive us. The book of Matthew chapter 6 verse 14 to 15. Matthew chapter 6 verses number 14 to 15. Matthew chapter 6 verses number 14 to 15 say, for if you forgive people their transgressions, if you forgive, if you learn to forgive the people that offends you, if you learn to let it go, then your heavenly father will also forgive you. Yes, if you don't forgive, don't think the number of times that you plead for forgiveness, God has forgiven you. No, he has not forgiven the principle is that you learn to forgive others. The number of times that you forgive, it is the same thing God will forgive. Daniel chapter 9 verses 9, the prophet was speaking. Daniel, the book of Daniel the prophet, 9 verse 9 said, The Lord our God is merciful and forgiving. The Lord our God is merciful. He is so merciful and forgiving. Even though we have rebelled against him, even though we've sinned against God, but he said, I have forgiven you. The same thing you have to also learn to forgive. Forgive your wife the number of times that she offends you. Forgive your sons and daughters. Do not release curses to your own property because your child has rebelled against you. Because your son has rebelled against you, because your daughter has rebelled against you, do not release curses, do not invoke curses onto the life of your property. Yes, forgive. Many of you, your, your children are even at the pit of death. They are on their way to die. They've apologized several times. You say, I will never forgive you. Your own daughter, you are finding it difficult to forgive her. Your own son, you are finding it difficult to forgive her. Forgive him. How do you expect God to forgive you? The number of times that you caused abortion. The number of times that you gossiped. The number of times that you put tears in the eye of your friends. The number of times that you rebelled against your mother when you were young. How do you want, how do you expect God to forgive you if you don't learn to forgive? If you're finding it difficult to forgive your husband, I tell you, your sins are, your sins have been loaded in a sack. God has placed your sins in a sack. He has never taken it away from you. Your sins are still there. The number of times that you forgive people, God will also forgive you. I keep telling you, sheep, cow, mullies, they will never wrong you the way human beings will wrong you. Cat will only come, get ourselves to come and eat your meat or something like that. By human being, each and every day, we held, we sin, we step on the foot of others. When you are a mother, when you are a parent, then you have children. Learn to forgive. Learn to forgive. Because if you don't forgive, you yourself, maybe you are good. You never step on the foot of anybody, but your son can step on the foot of somebody. Your daughter can step on the foot of somebody. Learn to forgive one another. Learn to forgive one another. Children, they forgive so easily. Children forgive and forget. They let it go so easily. So that is what Jesus Christ said. If we, if we don't change to be like this toddlers, it is difficult for us to go through the narrow gate, which is the kingdom of God. We can never enter into the kingdom of God. There is no way. It doesn't matter. You see, this afternoon I was telling, I was, I was speaking to one lady. I told her, you are not putting any makeups. You are not putting any mini skirt. You are not dressing sexy. That will attract a man to even uh, impregnate you. Let me say it that way. Like somebody who doesn't know Christ, who is into fornication, who doesn't fear God. 
You are not doing all these things. And you don't have good character. That will attract man. How do you expect to get husband? And she was so quiet on the phone. How do you expect? Because either you seduce the man for him to impregnate you. For the Lord to force him to marry you. Yes. Or you use your attitude, your character. To draw the man closer to you. And you, you don't have a good character. You don't know how to speak. You don't know how to forgive. The little thing, it is difficult. You keep grudges in your heart. You keep grudges in your heart. Many of you, the grudges in your heart is even driving away the Holy Spirit. Because the Holy Spirit, there is no vacancy for him in your heart. There is no vacancy for the Holy Spirit in your heart. You are keeping grudges. It is difficult for you to forgive. It is difficult for you to let it go just like that. It is so hard. It is so painful. It pains you that somebody, yes, has offended you and you want to repay the person to the extent that that person will share tears. Let it go. Forgive and forget. Let it go. Forgive and forget. If you don't learn to forgive, your heavenly father can never forgive you. Give me one minute to see my baby. Give me one minute. Just one minute. Keep sharing. Keep sharing. Keep sharing. Keep sharing. Keep sharing as you wait for me. Keep sharing. Very soon we start prayers very soon. We will start prayers very soon. Keep sharing and the Lord will bless you. 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 Yes, keep sharing, keep sharing, keep sharing, keep sharing, keep sharing. Thank you, Jesus. Let us all learn to forgive. Be like a child if you want to make to heaven. Be like a toddler, a toddler. A child that doesn't know, that doesn't keep grudges in the heart. Because you can change the physical body so easily. Physical appearance within 24 hours. You can get rid of all these artificial makeups. You can get rid of all these nails. You can get rid of all these short knicker and short mini skimpy dressings. You can just throw it away. But to let it go in your heart is divinely. It's divinely. Is divinely learn that attitude, let it go. That is the second I saw on toddlers, they easily let it go. That we need to learn if you want to qualify to be a candidate of heaven, learn to forgive. Do not condemn so easily. Have you ever seen children say, Hey, you go to hell? No, they accept. They draw anybody closer to them. It doesn't matter if it's not the parent that will that will that will straightly warn the, the, the daughter that don't go near a black lady, don't go near a fair, a fair baby, don't play with them. Children doesn't discriminate, children doesn't know this is black, this is why they will just hug you. Yes, this is what God wants us to learn. This is what God is expecting us. The attitude of children should be seen. It should manifest in our life. Yes, children, they easily forgive. They easily let it go. Forgive and let it go. Forgive and forget. Stop condemning people. Because God didn't come here to condemn the sinners. He came to rescue the, the souls that are perishing. The book of Luke chapter 6 verse 37. The book of Luke chapter 6 verses number 37. He said, do not judge, and you will not be judged. Do not condemn, and you will not be condemned. Forgive, and you will be forgiven. It's a principle. Learn it, and you can go through the, the, the narrow gate. Forgive, let it go. Allow it to go. And finally, the third point, then we start praying. The third point that I learned on children. Children are loving. They love unconditionally. They love so much. They love. Children love. That is, they have a, a heart that love. We should also have that heart of toddlers. Love your people. Jesus Christ said, even your enemy love them. Even your enemy. That person that is seeking to, to, to 
destroy you. Jesus Christ, they love them. When they are hungry, give them food to eat. When they are, they, they are naked, clothe them. Cover them. Cover them. The book of 1 Corinthians chapter 13, verse 4 to 5. 1 Corinthians chapter 13, verses number 4 to 5. You say, love is patient. Children are so patient. Come. Come. Be patient. Learn to exercise patience. As a born again Christian. As a believer. As a son or daughter of the kingdom. Learn to be patient. Do not rush. Do not rush. Do not rush to speak. Sometimes when you are angry. Sometimes when somebody provoke you, learn to swallow your saliva. Speak less when you are angry. Speak less when somebody provoke you. You see, exercise patience in everything. Exercise patience. Be silenced where silence is needed. Do not talk. Be silenced. I keep telling you, the, the couples that are in marriage, Marriage men, marriage women, patient. You see, there is no institution on this earth that your Christian faith is tested. Except in marriage. From loving to patient, from patience to endurance, from endurance to long suffering, from long suffering to trust and faith. You have to trust and you obey. If you don't have these qualities, it will be very difficult. It will be very difficult. You can never please God. Because if you can't put your home in order, you cannot come to the presence of God and derive any blessing. No favor. No favor. Love is patient. Children are patient. Love is kind. Learn to be kind to people. Show kindness to people. Comfort the nakedness of people. Learn to show kindness. If, if somebody have wronged you, if somebody have any way step on your foot, do not uncover all their secrets. Learn to be kind, a little bit kind. Just like that. Learn to show kindness. When you miss somebody sleeping of an empty stomach, learn to share the little you have with them. Kindness. Kindness. Some of the children, you can see this quality. You give them one, they divide it and give half to their friend. Yes. That is why children easily get witchcraft. Yes. When you give candy, they easily give to their friends. They easily share everything in their hands. This is what God wants us to be. Before we can qualify to be called the kingdom citizens. The kingdom citizens. Before we can be among the greatest that qualified for the kingdom of God, we need to show kindness. The next is, it's a love that's not boast. Stop boasting. All the fingers are not the same. All fingers are not the same. We will still have the poor. We will still have the people that, that if you find it difficult to feed, they will be there. And we will still have the worldly billionaires. All fingers are not the same. Stop using your, your wealth to make people feel so, so, so bad. Like God didn't create them. Stop using your property to drive away souls from Christ. Stop using that your high hill, that your, 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 your China way. Stop using it. Stop using that your Gucci, that your Gucci that you bought in, that somebody haven't gotten it. Stop using it to drive away souls from Christ. For all fingers are not the same. Love doesn't boast, but love shares all what he or she have with the poor. This is love. This is love. This is love. Love doesn't boast. It is not proud. Because the attitude of Jesus, Jesus in any way is not proud. It's meek. That is why he said, look unto me. Be like me. For I am so meek. I am so meek. Meek doesn't, doesn't mean that you don't, oh, you don't, you don't, oh, he doesn't know how to speak. Or she doesn't know how to speak. That is not it. It's like you reverent, you submit, you have the strength, you have the power to attack the person, but to submit under Christ. Submitting is power that is put under control. Strength that is put under control. You have the strength to fight that person, but for Christ's sake, let it go. You have the power, you have the zeal, you have everything. 
to respond or to reply that beast that is standing in front of you like 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 Goliath. You have everything, you have the wealth, you have the strength, you have the, the influence. Yes, to speak, to reply that person, but let it go. For Christ's sake, let it go. Let it go. For Jesus Christ's sake, let it go. Love is not proud. Love is not proud. Love is not proud. Love is not self-seeking. It doesn't seek for her, his or her own, but seeks for the, for the well-being of others. They seek for the well-being of others. Yes. You have to seek for the well-being of others. Learn to help others. Learn to push others forward. Learn to allow people to go. Rather than blocking them because you haven't gotten to the level that you can go. It is not time for you to move. It is time for somebody to move. Push the person. Yes. Push the person. If it is your wife, push your wife. If it is your husband, push your husband. Do not be so, so, so greedy or selfish or something like that. Like when you see many of the men, when they see their wife progressing, they feel so bitter within them. They feel bitter within them because their own wife is progressing. Because your own husband is rising, you feel bitter. You feel so, 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 so bad. No, push them. Seek the well-being of others. Because if all these things is not practiced on this earth, I tell you, you can never inherit the kingdom of God. You can never inherit the kingdom of God. You can throw all the, all the earrings away. Throw it away. Throw all the jewelry away. Throw it. Let, wear that long bone. That the, the Hermes alone can, can seal skirt or, or can seal straight dress for toddler. If you don't practice this, you are not a kingdom citizen. You doesn't qualify. The Holy Spirit is not even in you because the help of the Holy Spirit would, would change you from that proudness to be meek, to be lowly, low, so low. Yes, it doesn't seek the well-being of itself, but seeks the well-being of others. It is not easy angered. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love, the attitude of children, it doesn't keep any record of wrong. Many of you, especially the couples, five years ago, 2018, 22nd June, Friday, what your husband did to you, what your wife did to you, you still keep it in hearts. You are still keeping the record and every year you celebrate the one year anniversary of that incident that your husband have apologized. Your husband have gone down his kneel to pray. You are still keeping that record. You are still keeping that record. Do you have the Holy Spirit that will qualify you to be a kingdom citizen? You still keep the record of that one error that your wife did. 13 years ago, you still keep that record in your hearts. And you, 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 you are proud to call yourself a kingdom citizen. Many of us here, when we ask, how many of you are holy? Are the holy people? Yeah. The holy people, they will lift up their hand. Why? Because they don't wear mini skirts. They don't wear skimpy dresses. They don't put on earring. They don't put on high heels. They don't put on any bag with jewelry. They don't even eat in dummy. They don't they don't eat they, they don't eat that so they think they are the holy but they are keeping records of wrongs in their hearts the records of wrong what the auntie did to her five years ago it is still in the heart she can't find place in her heart to forgive what the aunt auntie did to her to, did to him that what she did 10 years ago is still in the heart we call ourselves holy. Yes, so oh, we call. Do we qualify for the kingdom? Do we really qualify? Are we on the narrow way or we are on the broad way? Testify yourself. Because those on the broad way, they don't deserve anything from God. Oh. Only one, one or two of them with a favor fall on them. I must tell you the truth. 
That is why sometimes I take my time to open the word of the, the mind of God, to speak the mind of God to you, so that you amend your ways to fit the crown that God has prepared to put on your head. Finally, finally, children, they are so low, so meek. The character, the attitude of children, they are meek. They, they don't have strength to fight anybody. They don't have strength. They are so meek. We can see Christ-like in children. As what Paul told the church of the Corinth. First Corinthians chapter 11 says, look unto me as I look unto Christ. Yes. You have, people have to see the Christ like in you. Can people see Jesus Christ in you as a Christian? As yourself. This is what the, the disciples, Jesus taught them. This is what he taught them. He said, if you want to be the greatest, if anyone among you want to be the elder, the leader, be like a toddler. Be like a toddler on this earth so that you can make it to heaven. When your head is swollen with prideness, when because of pride, your head is swollen to the extent that you can't even humble yourself. I tell you, your crown can never fit your head. The crown, it can never fit your head. It can never fit your head. The book of Proverbs chapter 16, verses number 18 going. It says, pride goes before destruction. Pride, the very moment you avail yourself for the spot of pride to rule over your life, destruction awaits you. You are heading towards destruction. You fall into a pit that it will be difficult for you to rise up because you don't have time to humble. You cannot humble yourself to listen to advice. That will direct you. You cannot humble yourself for people to teach you because you feel so proud that, oh, I don't, I don't need anybody to teach me. All knowing, all wise. We are wise on our own. We feel so wise. We feel that, oh, nobody have to teach me. I, I know everything. I know everything. Pride goes before destruction. Humble yourself. Humble yourself so that we all come to Jesus. Humble yourself. Speak good of one another. The book of Titus chapter 2. Titus 3 verse 2, my final verses, and we start praying. Titus chapter 3 verses 2, it said, to speak, evil, to speak evil of no one, to avoid quarreling. When we say somebody is Christ-like, there is no way in any way we saw Jesus Christ in the street quarreling or fighting with people, no. So the attitude, the nature of Christ have to manifest in our life. He said, we should not be going around quarreling with people. We should not speak evil against somebody. We should not speak evil against our, our, our friends, our siblings, our parents, anybody. Speak good. He said, avoid quarreling. To be gentle and to show perfect courtesy towards all people. Show perfect courtesy. Towards all people. Jesus Christ, he showed, he, he was an, he did an exemplary thing that we need to learn. He showed courtesy to all people. He was kind. He was loving. He doesn't discriminate. He doesn't, you see, anybody that comes to Christ, he just welcome him. Be like Christ. Be like a toddler so that you can walk through the narrow gates. Be like a child. Be like a toddler. Whatever is keeping you in prideness, I pray tonight God will take it away from you. Whatever is making your crown unable to fit you, whatever has caused you to swell to the extent that the crown is not fitting you, I pray tonight God will take it away from you and humble you and humble you and humble you and direct you for you to walk through the narrow gate. I pray to you any soul under the sound of my voice that is still in darkness. Jesus Christ has retrieved us. He has delivered us from darkness. I pray you come back from that darkness. You come out from 
that mess. You come out from that fornication. You come out from that hatred. You come out from that backbiting, envy, hatred. Oh, hating people for no reason. Come out from them. The book of Matthew chapter 11 verse 28. Jesus Christ said, come to me. All who labored and heavy laden and overburdened, and I will give you rest. I will, I will say, I will give you rest. Come to me tonight. I want you to appear before the throne. Come to Jesus, open your heart, and pray, pray for forgiveness. Pray for God to take away anything in you, any bitterness in you, anything that is that is that is closing doors in your life, anything that, that has shattered your destiny down. I want you to open your mouth and pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, forgive me anything, anything, and restore my heart. Take away any iniquity. I confess my sins tonight. I confess my sins tonight. I confess my sins tonight, and I pray for forgiveness. I pray for forgiveness forgiveness the number of times oh all the grudges in my heart father in the name of jesus take away every bitterness from my heart take away every bitterness take away every pains in my heart every pains in my heart every pains in my heart every every record of error that i am keeping in my heart tonight in the name of jesus at this moment father in the name of jesus i surrender everything i surrender my life i surrender my life i surrender my life take all in me and give me much of you oh my god take all of me and give me much of you my god take all of me and give me much of you my god take all of me and give me much of you i pray tonight father i appear before your throne your holy sanctuary your holy sanctuary, your holy sanctuary, your holy sanctuary, in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, I appear before your holy sanctuary, your holy sanctuary, your holy sanctuary, forgive me all my sins, forgive me all my sins, and destroy every deposit in my life, every deposit in my life, every garment of iniquity, every garment of iniquity, every garment of fornication, every garment of fornication, every garment of pride, every Every garment of arrogance, every garment of lust, in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, Father, in the name of Jesus, I command every negative garment on me to catch fire in the name of Jesus. Let every negative garment, let every negative garment, let every negative garment, in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, I renounce every every error in the name of Jesus. Forgive me, my God. Forgive me, my God. Take away any garment. Take away any garment. Garment of filthiness. Garment of filthiness. Garment of filthiness. Garment of hatred. Garment of hatred. Garment of hatred. Garment of hatred. In the name of Jesus. Take it away. 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 And restore in me, my God, the fruit of this, the fruit of this poet. Father, from tonight, I decree and declare to my life that I shall bear the fruit of this poet. I declare, I shall from today onwards, I will bear the fruit of love. I will bear the fruit of joy. I will bear the fruit of long suffering. I will bear the fruit of long suffering in the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Ghost. I decree and declare I am coming out from any suppression, any suppression, any spot oppressing me, any spot oppressing me, any spot manipulating me, manipulating my mind, manipulating my husband, manipulating my sons, manipulating my daughters in the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Ghost. I am coming out. I am coming out. I am coming out. I decree and declare. I am coming out. 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 Open your mouth to pray. Open your mouth to pray. Open your mouth to declare. I am coming out in the name of Jesus. I am coming out in the name of Jesus. Whatever is keeping me in pits, in pits, in a deep pit in my life, whatever is keeping my destiny in a deep pit, Whatever is keeping you in darkness, whatever is keeping you all in that hardship, whatever is keeping you in that difficulties, whatever is keeping you in that pains, in that sorrow, in that agony, in the name of Jesus, in that bitterness, in that bitterness, in that bitterness, I declare, you are coming out, you are coming out, you are coming out, you are coming out.
coming out. You are coming out. You are coming out. In the name of Jesus. You are coming out. In the name of Jesus. Whatever is making people make mockery of you. Oh my God, what is making people make mockery of you? The God we serve is not a God that, that, that we mocked. God is not to be mocked. God is not to be mocked. Whatever is on me, whatever situation, whatever condition that I am in now, that is paving way for people to mock me. That is paving way for people to sabotage me, stigmatize me. In the name of Jesus, I decree and declare, you are coming out of that thing. 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 In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost. You are coming out. You are coming out. You are coming out. You you are coming out. You are coming out. You are coming out. You are coming out. I command that destruction of anything implanted in your life. I command that destruction of everything, anything implanted, implanted, implanted in your life to delay you, to delay you, to delay you, to delay you, to disadvantage you, to disadvantage you, to disadvantage you, to delay your life, to frustrate you, to frustrate you, to limit you, to limit you. In the name of Jesus, I decree and declare, you are coming out. 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 In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, you are coming out right now. 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 Your husband is coming out. My God, your sons and daughters are coming out. Oh, leka biende makapa yadosa. Your family is coming out of that darkness. It is time. It is time to put an end to all the dark, dark, the things of the dark, things of the dark. These, 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 these that are destroying the temple of God. Things that are preventing, oh, that are, that are, that are hindering the blessings of God, the favor of God, the glory of God. The Bible says for all have sinned and fell short to the glory of God. It is iniquity that drives away the glory of God from our life. It is that smoking, that fornication, oh, that alcohol that you are taking. That ha people's husband that you are sleeping with, that people's wife that you are sleeping with, it is this that is driving away the glory. It is this that is that that is taking away the glory. Oh, in the name of Jesus, I pray you are coming out of that pit. Any pit that you are in, any pit that is full of darkness, that is full of dark deeds, evil deeds, wicked deeds, wicked mindset, wicked manipulations. In the name of Jesus, I decree and declare: she are coming out. She are coming out you 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 are coming out whatever has given access whatever be your own iniquity because yesterday I was talking to you about disobedient disobedient can build a war between you and your blessing disobedient can let you lose so many things in your life Many of the things that we are going through, sometimes we attribute all to witches. But many of them, when we focus on our life, when we close our eye and think deeply to the things that we've done of our past, we can understand that many of the things that we are going through is as a result of our past deeds. If you haven't shared, share. May God release your heart to share this message and God will bless you. May God release your heart to share. May God release your heart to share anything of your past. Let's pray this prayer point. Anything of your past that, that has built a wall between you and your favor, between you and your blessing in the name of Jesus, let that thing catch fire. 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 In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost. Anything that has built a wall. 
Anything of your past, any deeds of your past, any deeds of your past, any deeds of your past that has built a wall, that has built a wall between you and your growing, between you and your blessing. In the name of Jesus, I command it to fall. 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 I release your destiny. 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 Wherever your destiny is, in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, I release it. I release it. I release it. Whatever access that you've given, knowingly or unknowingly, or to the altars in your father's house, to the altars in your mother's house, through your iniquity, to afflict your life, to fight your life, to fight your life, to fight your life. In the name of Jesus, I withdraw that access. I withdraw that access. I withdraw that access. I withdraw that access. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Any access that you've given, any access, knowingly or unknowingly, that you've given to altars in your father's house, altars in your place of birth, altars in your place of birth, to afflict your life, to afflict your life, to afflict your life, to afflict your life, to afflict your life. Oh my God, in the name of Jesus, I command that altar to catch fire, let that altar 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 catch Catch fire, let the autumn catch fire in the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Ghost. Yes, any altar, any altar of, of failure that we ourselves have given, uh, uh, we, we've given access, we've given access to them all to affect our life, to destroy our life. To put our destiny in the in the lane in the level where everybody will rise up and fall in the family, in the name of Jesus. Oh, tonight I declare deliverance to your soul. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. Let's change our our prayer topic. Let's move to another dimension. Let's move to another dimension. Let's move to another di dimension. In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost. Wherever your destiny is being buried, wherever they've buried all the good things in your life, wherever the devil have gotten access to take all the riches from your life, all the good things from your life, and buried it, all your the fruit of your womb, your riches, your wealth, all your long life, any good thing in your life that is buried now in the name of Jesus. I excavate it, 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 I, I uproot anything that is buried on my life, in my life, in my life, in my life, anything that the devil has gotten access, that the dragon, that the serpent has gotten access to. To swallow, to swallow because of my iniquity, because of my past deeds, because of my disobedience, because of my disobedience, because of my pride, because of my pride. In the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, I approve everything. I approve everything. I approve everything. I approve everything that is implanted, that is implanted, that is implanted, that is implanted. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I approve. I approve. Approved wherever anybody, any demon, any witch power, or oh, have buried my own clothing. Wherever they've buried my clothing, wherever they've buried all the good things in my life, wherever they've buried it in the name of Jesus, I approve it. 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 In the name of Jesus, I approve it. Whatever they've buried all the good things, or causing brokenness in my life, or causing rejections in my life, bringing struggles here and there. 
denials here and then that when I go for job, when I go and look for anything, they will they will just deny me. Anywhere I go, I come home with disgrace. Anywhere I go, I come home with shame. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, tonight, let that heavy, let that false burden be lifted permanently. Let that false burden be lifted permanently. Let that false burden be lifted permanently. The false burden that has broke my way, the false burden that is giving me Oh my God, that is disadvantaging me. That is that is blocking me and giving access to others to bypass me, to overcome me, to overcome me. That is that has blocked me and giving access oh to the gentle, to the hearing, to ride on my horse, to ride on my horse, to ride on my horse, to occupy my position, to occupy my place, to occupy my position. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I withdraw the access. I withdraw the access. I withdraw the access that my own iniquity have given all oh, to the devil to manipulate my life. That my own sins have paved way for the, the, the enemy, for the devil to afflict my life. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I destroy, I destroy, I destroy, and we declare breakthrough in our finances. We declare breakthrough. We declare victory. We declare victory. We declare liberation. We declare breakthrough in the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Ghost. We declare breakthrough over every problem, over every situation, over every heavy mountain, over every heavy river in front of us. In the name of Jesus, we overcome it. We overcome it. Every challenges, every challenges, every challenges, every challenges. In the name of Jesus, we overcome. We overcome, 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 and we revoked, my God, the power of the enemy. We revoked the power of the enemy standing on our way, preventing us. Standing on our way, preventing our forward movement, the enemy all standing on our way, preventing our elevation, preventing our progress. Oh my God, we destroy them, we scatter them. Anybody standing on your way, saying no way, saying no way, saying no way, I will never let you go, I will never let you go. Anybody standing on our way, blocking us, wherever you are, we assign, we command the sword of God, we assign, we command the sword of God to chase you wherever you want, 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 to chase you wherever you want. In the name of Jesus, the sword of God, anybody, anybody standing our way, standing our way, blocking our way, blocking our way, blocking our forward movement. In the name of Jesus, we command the sword of God to tear them, to dismantle them, to destroy them. Any that they are using to block our way, to block our forward movement, to block our forward movement. In the name of Jesus, we command it to cut fire. Let it 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 cut fire. Anything. Oh, anywhere. They've assigned any agent, any giant, any messenger of the devil. To confront you anytime there is a blessing, anytime any good thing is coming, anywhere they prepare or they project or they design that problem, whoever has been designing that problem, oh, to come and take away the good thing that is coming, to come and confront, to come and hinder the good blessings that God has released. Let the designer oh, visit their airy grave. Let the designer, let the programmer, let him paralyze, let her paralyze, let him paralyze, let her paralyze, let him paralyze, let her paralyze, let him paralyze. 
Let her paralyze in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, let him paralyze. Let her paralyze any designer, any designer of fortune, any designer of problems, any designer of problems, issues in our life, issues in our life, sicknesses in our life, any designer of sicknesses in our life, whatever you are, receive fire, 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 whatever they are, receive fire, whatever you are, I send Holy Ghost fire, I send 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 fire in the north, I send fire in the south, I send fire in the east, I send fire in the west, I send fire under the waters, in the air, in the sky, on the earth, in the earth, under the world, under world, in the name of Jesus, wherever you are, receive fire, wherever you are, I scatter you, I scatter you, I scatter you, let the consuming fire of God consume you, scatter you, dismantle you, dismantle you, discomfort you, in the name of Jesus Christ. Any table that they've prepared for you, being accident, to get accident, to die prematurely, to be disgraced, to be embarrassed, for people to just look down upon you, wherever they've prepared a table for you, I command that table to overturn. <laughs> wherever they've prepared any table for you, in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, let the table overturn. 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 Anywhere they've prepared, oh, they've planned to disgrace you. Let them be disgraced. Let them be disgraced. Anywhere they've planned to push you to your airy grave. To push you to your airy grave. In the name of Jesus. Let the angel of God push them to their airy grave. Let the angel of God push them to their airy grave. In the name of Jesus by the power of the Holy Ghost. Every plans of the enemy against our life. We command it to cut fire. Every projection of the enemy against our life, we command it to cut fire. Every evil projections, evil programmings, evil projections, evil programmings against our life in the name of Jesus, we command it to cut fire. 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 fire. Oh, all, all what they've projected against our husband, against our wife, against our family, against our nation Ghana, against our, our business, against our investment, against our job, against our ministry, against oh my God, our brand, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, against our finances, against our promotion, oh against our promotion, against our promotion, in the name of Jesus, let it catch fire, let it catch fire, let it catch fire, let all evil projections, evil projections, Evil programming, evil programming, satanic programming, satanic calendars, satanic timetables. Release, 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 release all what they planned in the month of November in the name of Jesus. As the month of November, oh my God, start out with no, start out with no. We say no to accident, we say no to accident. We refused, we refused to be victimization, we refused to be victimized. We we refused. Oh my God. We refused. We refused. We refused every program of the devil. We, re we, we reject it. 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 All demonic programmings. All their plans in the month of November. We cancel every accident. In the month of November, we come against any spot of death on assignment. Any angel messenger of death. Messenger of death, messenger of death, 
On last time, we arrest you. 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 Any messenger of infirmity, sickness, any pestilence releasing to the end, any pestilence releasing to the end, any pestilence releasing onto the land, into the waters, into the waters to cause water bond disease or to cause air pollution or to cause air pollution. We arrest that pestilence. We arrest that pestilence. We arrest that pestilence. We arrest that pestilence. In the name of Jesus, we in the name of Jesus, we cancel everything that is programmed against our life. In the month of November, in the month of November, we cross all the old chapters, all the old chapters, all the old chapters that was opened by the witches in our family. All the old chapters, all that was opened to delay us, to delay us, to delay us, to block us, to resist us, to, to prohibit us. In the name of Jesus, tonight we cross that old chapter. We cross that old chapter by fire by tender. We set fire into that old garment. We set fire into that old problem. We set fire into that old issue. We set fire into that tragedy. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, my God. Today we break all unseen barriers. All the unseen barriers. <coughs> the barriers that we can't see. Hmm. My God, the barriers that they've laid, the barriers that they've built, that we can't see, the unseen barriers, in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, my God, we break out, 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 by fire, in the name of Jesus, all the unseen barriers in our life, cross territories, Close doors, close gate. My God, in the name of Jesus, we break out, 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 wherever. My God, they built a wall like the Jericho to prevent us from moving forward. Wherever there is a Jericho, unseen Jericho, unseen Jericho, Jerichos, my God, break out, break out, break out, break out, break out, release to us our blessings that are in the custody of the evil ones, that are in the warehouse of the enemy, our breakthroughs, Father, as we enter the month of November, Release to us our children. Release to us our wolf. That is in the dark world. That is in the warehouse of the enemy. The things that they've gotten access to steal from our life. The things that they've gotten access to take away. Father, in the name of Jesus, release to our life. Release to our life. Release to our life. Release to our life. Release to us. In the name of Jesus, release our blessings. Oh my God. Release our breakthrough. Release our testimonies. Our signs. Release to your children. In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost. Release to your children. Release to your children. Their deliverance, their healing, their breakthrough. In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost. Release to them divine anointing. Father, open heavenly portals. Open heavenly portals. And rain your blessings. Rain your children. Rain, rain upon the life of your children. Oh my God, rain blessings. Rain healing. In the month of November. In the month of November, in the month of November, my God, in the name of Jesus. Everything that is impossible in our life. Anything that doctors have declared impossible. Father, we know there is nothing. Nothing is impossible in your sight. Anything that doctors have declared impossible, I declare it possible in the life of your children. In the name of Jesus, by the power of
of the Holy Ghost. Anything declared impossible, I declared it possible. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ, anything that is impossible, my God, right now, let it be possible. Let it be possible. Any issue that we are having in court, or that we are having in court, any issue, any issue in court, my God, I declare victory to the life of your children. Whatever your children are supposed to appear before court this November for their document, for their document, for their property, or for their property, or for their compensations. My God, in the name of Jesus. My God, in the name of Jesus. My God, in the name of Jesus. I release and I declare victory. 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 Let your children return with a new song in their mouth. A new song of joy, a new song of thanksgiving, a new song of thanksgiving. Any problem at court, anywhere that this month of November, anybody that is supposed to appear before court, Father, in the name of Jesus, let that person return with a, a song of joy. Let that soul, any soul that will visit court this November, Father, in the name of Jesus, oh my God, let that person return with a song of thanksgiving, with a song of joy, with a song of joy, with a song of joy. I cancel every case in the, in the realms of the spirit. Every case, every case that is different difficult to resolve. That is difficult to resolve. That is difficult to resolve. I cancel it in the name of Jesus. I cancel it in the name of Jesus. I cancel it in the name of Jesus. Receive a testimony. Oh, favor. Favor. Receive a favor. That will speak for you whenever you go to court. That will speak for you where your voice cannot express yourself. Where your own oh, grammar cannot even speak for you. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Receive the favor. Receive the favor. Receive the favor. Receive the favor. Wherever your own voice cannot speak for you. I pray the grace of God will speak for you. Oh, I I declare the glory of God will speak for you. I declare the favor of God will never leave you. The spirit of God will speak to somebody. In the name of Jesus Christ. 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 Wherever. Yes. Wherever. Anybody is planning, any prosecutor, any judge, any lawyer, or is planning or to pass wrong judgment. My God, my God, my God, my God, cause them to be confused until they pass right judgment, until they pass right judgment. Father, confuse their mind. 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 Let them pass right judgment. Let them pass right judgment judgment. Let them pass right judgment for your sons and daughters. Father, vindicate them. Let your children be acquitted and discharged for the wrong, from misjudgment, from misjudgment, from misjudgment, from misjudgment. Let your children be acquitted and discharged. Let them be acquitted and discharged. Let them be acquitted and discharged. Let them be acquitted and discharged. I cancel any spell that will move through any prosecutor to, to, to make judge you any power anywhere anybody who use charm my god in the name of jesus i send the spiritual charm of god in that courtroom 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 oh i send the spiritual charm of god anybody that is using charm oh for them to pass wrong judgment oh my god Father, confuse their mind until they finish passing ju the judgment. Confuse the mind of the prosecutors that have taken talking, that have that, that, that have received something to pass wrong judgment. 
Oh, on the soul of the poor, the poor person that couldn't give anything to them. My God, in the name of Jesus, my God, in the name of Jesus, confuse them, confuse them to cancel every case, confuse them to cancel every case, confuse them in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes. Father, I pray right now. I pray right now. Whatever our brothers, our sisters, our parents, our, our husbands and wife, whatever they are in prison, Father, in the name of Jesus, Father, in the name of Jesus, release an escape, 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 divine escape. Make a way for them to come out from that prison. All those in prison in Libya, in the name of Jesus, all those in prison in Saudi Arabia, Iraq, Kurdistan, South Africa, United States of America, oh, Asia, wherever you are, wherever you are in prison, for the iniquity that you haven't committed, for, for misjudging, for misjudging, for misjudging, or oh, for, for the sake of document, Father, in the name of Jesus, make an exit. Oh, Father, release an exit for them to come home, for them to come home, for them to come home. Father, uh, take away death sentence. Take away death sentence from the life of our brothers, that are in prison in a foreign land or in a, in, a, in, a, in in a strange land in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus release our brothers in prison our brothers our sons our husbands that are dying in prison oh my God for the iniquity that they haven't done oh father for the sins that they haven't committed release our brothers release our brothers set them free my God set them free my God let their case be visited let their case be visited let their let their case be visited. Let their case be visited. Let their issue be crossed. Let it be investigated. Let the investigation team, Father, assign them, assign them, assign them. Put heavenly pressure on them for them to investigate their cases. Let them investigate their cases. Let them investigate their cases. Father, let them be granted. Oh, let them be free. Free them, my God. Free them, my God. Free them, my God. Free them, my God. Holy Spirit. Yes, today is defense the second of november father your daughters that are carrying your 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 new souls your daughters that are pregnant oh that will be visiting the labor world that will be visiting the labor world in this month of november in the name of jesus i declare safe delivery i declare safe delivery and i arrest any spirit of any spirit of any spirit of uh, um uh, just a minute, my baby has started. Just a minute. Just a minute. Just a minute. Just a minute. Le kabian de makapa ya dosa. Le intorobo masun dayama. Zuri makata yama le antarma makabian de. Makapa ya dosa. Le intorobo masun dayama. Zobro koto le antarma makapa. Zuri makatayama le andarma makabia de my god 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 in the name of jesus deliver your pregnant women all those visiting the labor world all those going to deliver father deliver them from the hands of the pharaohs, the dragons, the dragons that are waiting for them oh, to give forth, to bring forth the baby in their womb, so that they devour them. In the name of Jesus Christ, I lift up pregnant women, globally, worldly. Father, I lift them into your hand. Protect them, deliver them from the hands of wrong, wrong and wicked and evil midwives and doctors. In the name of Jesus, deliver them. Deliver their unborn babies. See Secure them, my God. Secure them, my God. Surround them with tender and fire. Surround them with tender and fire. In their labor world, in their delivery room, in their delivery room, in their delivery room, wherever they are, I assign your spirit of God, your spirit of God, your angels of God, with a sword, with a sword in their hand. Let them go to the labor world. Let them go to deliver your children. Father, in the name of Jesus, I come against any, 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 any issue, any issue, <coughs> any issue, any issue, 
any issue, any issue of childbirth. Father, in the name of Jesus, I come against it. Wherever the devil has planned for us to lose any of the soul through delivering, Father, I cancel it. Any body, any body, any body, any pregnant woman that, that they prepare such a table for them, I cancel it in the name of Jesus. I cancel it in the name of Jesus. I cancel it in the name of Jesus. I declare you will deliver us the Jewish woman, as the Hebrew woman, oh, travel so easily, so you shall travel, as the Hebrew woman, travel so easily, so you shall travel, in the name of Jesus, I pray for all those that you are seeking for document, that you be visiting court, this November for your document, Father, in the name of Jesus, go before them, Father, go before your sons and daughters, those in a place that they want another way to transit, to make a transit to another nation. Make a way for them, my God. Make a way for them, my God. Remember them, O oh Lord. 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 Release their document to them. All those that are finding it difficult to get a job in the name of Jesus, may God see you through. I establish that connection, that divine connection, that divine connection, and I arrest the spirit of denial from your life. I arrest the spirit of denial from your life. The spirit that will cause them to deny you, to reject you, to reject you, to reject you. In the name of Jesus, I arrest that spirit in the name of Jesus, and I open all closed doors for your life. All the closed doors. I open it in the name of Jesus. I open it. All closed doors. Doors. Doors that is closed in your life. In the name of Jesus. I open it. I command it to open. I command it to open. Oh my God. As we enter a new month. Do something new in the life of your sons and daughters. As we enter a new month. My God in the name of Jesus. Do something new. Do something new. Do something new. Open new doors. Open new doors. Open new doors. Open new opportunities. Connect your sons and daughters. Connect your sons and daughters. Establish that connection. Divine connection. Divine connection. Divine connection. Connection, divine connection, divine connection, divine connection in the name of Jesus. Establish it, divine connection. Connect your sons and daughters to their destined helpers that will open a wild door, a wild door, a wild door in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, open cross doors in the life of your sons and daughters. Open cross doors, my God. Open cross doors, my God. Open cross doors, my God. Open my that does whatever is delaying in the life of your sons and daughters in their marriage in their marriage in the name of Jesus open open cross doors my God open healing doors my God healing doors in the name of Jesus healing doors in the name of Jesus healing doors my God oh open 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 oh jobs father your word say a hand that doesn't work shouldn't eat too your children, because of the pandemic, Father, they are jobless. They are jobless. They are finding it difficult to get a job. My God, may you connect them. Oh, may you connect them. Make a way for them. We're making father. We're making father. We're making father. We're making father. Make a way for them. Make a way for them. Make a way for them. We're making God. We're making God. We're making God. We're making God. Make a way for them. <clears throat> Make a way for them. Make a way for them. Arrest all those standing on their way. Arrest them, my God. All those standing on their way. <clears throat> my God, in the name of Jesus. Arrest them. Arrest them. Arrest them and clear their way. 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 Guide their steps, my God. Guide the steps of your, of your sons and daughters. Father, guide their steps. Father, guide their steps. Father, guide their steps, my God. Guide. All those going into prison because of the death. Because of death. Because of death. As a result of the pandemic, 
Oh my God. Oh, those that have lost their, 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 their finances. Oh, their, their income because of the pandemic. Oh, those that went for government loan. Oh, that because of the pandemic. They are in debt. Father, make a way for them. You are the way making God restore them. Restore them. Restore them. Restore them. Restore them. Restore them. In the name of Jesus, your sons and daughters that are still at home, finding it difficult to get job after the pandemic. Oh my God. After the lockdown, your sons and daughters that are finding it difficult to get job, make a way for them. We're making God. 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 In the name of Jesus, Father, make a way for them. Make a way for them. Make a way for them. Oh, Father, make a way for them. Oh, make a way for them. Lord God Almighty, make a way for them. Let the crooked places that your sons and daughters are working on, the crooked places in their life, Father, make it straight for them. Make all the crooked places straight. Oh, Father, make all the crooked places straight. Make all the crooked ways straight. In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, all the crooked ways. All the crooked ways, all the crooked ways, Father, make it straight. Father, make it straight in the name of Jesus. Make all the rock, the rock places. Oh, make it plain for your children. Level their, their destiny. The ups and downs bring to an end. The ups and downs bring to an end in their life. Bring to an end all the ups and downs, the challenges that they are going through. What is putting tears in their eye? Father, what is taking away their joy? What has taken away their joy? Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, make a way for them. All the, every problem that you are having in your workplace, in the name of Jesus, I command it to come to an, an alignment with the word of God, with the work of God, with the work of Jesus. Any problem that you are having in your workplace, I arrest that problem in the name of Jesus. I arrest every problem that you are facing in the name of Jesus. And I command, I command, I command that storm that is blowing in your life to still. Let that storm still. Let that storm still. Let every storm, every storm, every storm in your life, let it be stilled. 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 Every chains of problem, I command it to be broken. Chains of problems, chains of problems, chains of problems, chains of issues, chains of issues, chains of issues. In the name of Jesus, I command it to be broken. Let it be broken. Let it be broken. Let it be broken. Jesus Christ. Yes. Share the broadcast and the Lord will bless you. I pray may God release your heart right now to share the broadcast. Share to groups. Any group that you find yourself, share and the Lord will bless you. Any group you find yourself, share and the Lord will bless you. Any group you find yourself, share and the Lord will bless you. Any group you find yourself, share as the Lord release it or take away all the burdens. Share your burdens away. Share your burdens away with faith. Share your burdens away. Share the issues. Share it away. The chains of the problem, share it among your enemies. As you share now, share your pains. Share all the problems, the chains of problems. Share it among, share it on the life of your enemies. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, all those that are sharing, share their problems on the life of their enemies. In the name of Jesus, divide it among them. Divide it among them. As Daniel told the king Nebuchadnezzar that let this dream oh, be the portion of your enemy. All those sharing right now, Holy Spirit, share their problem. What they are going through now. The burdens on them now. The false 
burden, the issue on them now. Father, in the name of Jesus, Father, in the name of Jesus, share it among their enemy. Share it on the life of their enemy. Share it on the life of their enemy. As they share, my God, share it on the life of their enemy. Share their problems right now. Holy Spirit, in the name of Jesus, share and arrest all programmers from their life. Arrest all those responsible for building altars. All those responsible for uh, enforcing things to happen, negativities to happen in their life. Father, in the name of Jesus, arrest them, arrest them, arrest them, and release all their blessings from the from the from the berry of the dragon. Release the blessings of your children. Oh, whatever it is, whatever they are, whether it is in the berry of the dragon. Whether it is in the mouth of the crocodile, whether it is in the mouth or, or in the belly of the elephant, Father, in the name of Jesus, release, I command, the release of the blessings of your children. I command the release of the promotion of your children. The breakthrough, my God, the breakthrough, release their breakthroughs to their life. Release their breakthroughs to their life. Release their breakthroughs to their life. In the name of Jesus, and release their wealth. Release the wealth of your children. Release the wealth of your children. Release their blessings. Release their blessings. Release their blessings. Release their blessings. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Father, in the name of Jesus. You are miracle working God. 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 Right now, do something new in the life of your sons and daughters. Right now, Father, do something new in their life. Right now, Father, let them possess their possession. As it is written, that the house of Jacob shall possess their possession. As it is written, that the house of Jacob shall possess their possession. Let your children possess their possession. Let your sons and daughters, oh, occupy their rightful position. In the name of Jesus Christ, let us occupy our rightful position. In the name of Jesus Christ, let them occupy their rightful position. Let them occupy their seat in their father's house, in their mother's house, their paternal, their maternal. My God, in the name of Jesus, every seat, my God, every throne bearing their name, bearing their signature, bearing their name, in the name of Jesus, let them occupy, let them occupy, we occupy, we occupy our rightful position and we drive away any dragon, any beast that is already already sitting on our, our throne, any dragon, any beast, oh, any Jezebel, any Jezebel, any Jezebel that is occupying our throne in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, we drive them by force, in the name of Jesus, we drive them by force, in the name of Jesus, we drive them by force, any body. Oh, that is saying he will never let us smile. Anybody that have sworn not to let you smile. Anybody, any witchcraft, any witch power, any wizard in your father's house, in your mother's house, among your own siblings, among your friends, that is saying I will never let you prosper. I will never let you be. I will never let you seek peace. I will never let you seek joy. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. We command all their projections to bounce back to them. All their plans against our life. All what they've released to our life. All the curses, the spells, the ill ways, uh, the, 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 the prayers of witchcraft that they prayed for our life. We, we command it to turn back to them. We send it 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 back to them. Anybody visiting the shrine. Anybody that have gone for spell. Anybody that have gone for chime because of you and I. Anybody that is taking our picture to the shrine. To the cultic pastors. To the witchcraft camp. To go and destroy our life. On their way going, I command them to paralyze. 
Let them paralyze. Let them paralyze. Let the angel of death meet them on their way. As the, as the light of God met Saul, the meddler. Let the angel of death meet anybody, everybody. That is on his or her way to go and destroy you. That is on his or her way to go and destroy your home. To go and break your home. To go and break your business. To go and collapse your business. To go and make sure you don't rise. To go and make sure you don't go forward. In the name of Jesus, let the angel of God paralyze them. Paralyze them. Paralyze them. Paralyze them. Paralyze them. Paralyze them. I command them to be paralyzed. Anybody on his or her way to go and destroy our life. Anybody going to buy sickness for us, anybody going to buy problem from the witchcraft market, demonic market, satanic market, anybody that is planning, that have that mentality, that is having that mindset to go and buy something to come and destroy you, to go visit the shrine, visit the native doctor, or visit the priest, visit wrong, wrong places, just to go for powers, just to go for charm, just to go for powers to come and fight you, to come and break you, to come and silence you, to come and stop you. In the name of Jesus, I assign the angel of death to meet them on their way. Let the angel of death meet them on their way. Let the angel of death arrest them on their way. Let the angel of death arrest them on their way. Let the angel of death arrest them on their way. Let the angel of death arrest them on their way. Whoever is calling your name in a wrong place, Whoever is calling your name in a wrong place, whoever is calling your name, calling the name of your business, calling the name of your ministry, calling the name of your brand, oh, your company, your company, your company, your business, your institution, calling your name, wherever, whoever, in the name of Jesus, we command the tender of God to strike down your mouth. The mouth that you are using to call the name of our ministry. The mouth that you are using to call the name of our first and second name. The name of our business. The name of our sons and daughters. The name of our husband. In the name of Jesus Christ, let the tender of God strike that mouth. Let the fire of God, the consuming fire, the consuming fire, consume them, consume them, consume them, consume them. Consume them. Wherever they are, right now, wherever they are, right now, everywhere, if they are under the water calling our name, if they are in the sky, if they are in the air calling our first and second name, just to cause us to, 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 to affect our life, anything that they've set in motion to come and break you, whether it's sickness, whether a stroke, whether it is a, 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 any sickness that will break you down, that you can't rise up and go and occupy the, that position that you occupy at your working place again. Anything that they've set in motion, I command it to go back. I send it back to where it is coming from. Anything that have, they've set in motion, they've set in motion, They've set in motion to come and destroy you, to come and kill you, wherever that you are, wherever that you are, in the land of Europe, North America, South America, oh my God, my God, Asia nations or Asia countries, Gulf countries, wherever you are, wherever you are, anything that they've set in motion, any part of Africa that they've set in motion to come and destroy you, to to come and destroy you. We commanded by force to back to the center. Let it go back where it is coming from. That powers, that powers, that powers, that powers, that powers, that is released to come and destroy us. That is released to come and break us. That is released to come and silence us. Let it go back. Let it go back. Let it go back where it is coming from. We command it. Let it backfire. Let it backfire. Command it. 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 Let it backfire. Jesus. Father, let all the wicked plannings 
Yes, let it backfire. Let all the, the wicked prance against our family, against our family, against our loved ones, against our nation, Ghana, Nigeria, all part of the world. The prance of the wicked people to cause war, to cause disunity, to cause economic problems, social problems. In the name of Jesus, let all their plans backfire. Let all their wicked plans backfire. Let all their wicked plans backfire. Let all their wicked plans backfire. Let all their evil plans backfire. Let all their evil plans backfire. All what they've set in motion in the month of November. All the snail we command it to be broken. Let every snail, snails to break us, snails to disgrace us, snails to hinder us, snails to broke us. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, we command it to be broken. Let it be broken 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 demonic snails satanic snails every trap every trap every trap we command you be broken right now yes we declare we are free from all these snails in the month of november we secure we command the protection of our family we command the protection of our every every good thing in our life in the month of november my god we command the protection of our family Oh, we command the protection of our family. We command the protection of the life of all those that concerns us, our destiny helpers, our sponsors, our sponsors, our destiny helpers. Father, protect them. Father, protect them. Father, protect them. Oh, Father, release their blessings. Release their long life. Release their protection. In the name of Jesus, in this month of November, in this month of New November, I destroy satanic projection. Father, I destroy all what they planned, all what they planned, all what they planned, all what they programmed, all what they programmed. In the name of Jesus, we dismantle by fire, we scatter 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 by fire. All what they planned, they projected for it to happen to us in the month of November. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, what they want, where they, wherever they want us to share tears. Wherever they want us to share tears. In this month. Oh my God. My God. My God. Whoever is wishing or planning for us to visit our early grave. Planning for our sons and daughters. Husbands and wives, my God, our parents, our siblings to visit their every grave. I cancel that plans. 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 In the month of November, we declare that we shall never bury any of our relatives. We shall never bury our husbands prematurely. We decree and declare we shall never bury. Our children in the month of November, in the month of November, in the month of November, in the name of Jesus Christ. We will never bury any of our children. Yeah, we will never bury any of our husband. We will never bury our wife prematurely. We decree and declare that we shall never oh be mourning our our husband. Ah, prematurely, no. It is error. For us to bury our children prematurely. It is error for us to bury our wife prematurely because it is declared that that the, the shall still be old. There shall still be old women and old men in the in the street of Jerusalem. It is declared, and our staff shall be in our hands. It is an error for us to die prematurely. It is an error for us to die prematurely. It is wrong for us to die prematurely. It is not our portion. It is not our portion. It is not our portion. We decree and declare. Oh, we decree and declare that we shall never die as a result of somebody's mistake. Oh, somebody's mistake. We shall never die as a result of any driver's mistake. 
any driver's mistake or oh, any any physician's mistake or oh, mistake from the nurse mistake from the doctor we shall never die we shall never die we shall never bury our sons and daughters as a result of somebody's error my god in the name of jesus we secure the life of our children we secure the life of our destined helpers we secure the life of our family in the name of jesus christ my god when the wicked people are seeking for our dwelling, Father, let them not find us. When the evil ones are seeking for the dwelling of your children, let them not find them. When the robbers, the robbers, oh, the robbers, the sourceless, the sourceless, when they are seeking for the dwelling place of your sons and daughters, and the life of all those that concern them. Father, may they not see them. May they not find them. May they not find them. May they not find them. I surround our dwelling with blood, the blood of the lamp. Oh, the blood. The blood, the blood that the Israels used to mark on their widows, that the angel of death, oh, didn't locate them, that the angel of death bypassed them. We surround our life, every department of our life, in this month of November. Ah, Father, if the armed robbers try on us, let them be arrested. If they targeted us, let them be arrested. Any wicked person that will target our life in the month of November, in this month of November, my God, in the name of Jesus, for our sake, let them be arrested. 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 My God, in the name of Jesus, when they find our dwelling, when they try oh, on us this time, let them be arrested. When they try on us this time, when they try to come and rob our business, when they try to come and shoot us in our home, when they try to chase us in our home, when they try to stop our car, Father, assign your mighty angels, your warriors, Michael, Father, assign them, assign them, let them be arrested, 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 them be arrested. in the name of Jesus Christ, yes. All those misrepresenting us, all those underground, secretly disgracing us, expose them all. Father, expose them all. Father, expose them all. All those misrepresenting us, all those tarnishing our integrity, tarnishing our reputation, tarnishing our image, stigmatizing us. My God, in the name of Jesus, expose them with fire, expose them by 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 fire. Anybody, oh my God, misrepresenting us, anybody that is tarnishing our image, sabotaging us. My God, in the name of Jesus, sabotaging your people. My God, in the name of Jesus, Father, tarnishing their image for no reason, for no reason, for, the, for hatred sake, for hatred, for the sake of jealousy, for the sake of envy, anybody tarnishing the image of your children, let them be exposed by fire. 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 Anybody that have gathered information about us, that is ready to release, to disgrace us. Anybody with our secrets, that is planning to release it. Let them visit their early grave. Yes. Anybody that have a vital information that would derail your life, that would derail your life, that they are planning to release it, 
just to let you commit suicide. I pray in the name of Jesus. On their way going, on their way going, let the angel of death through accident catch them on a way. Let the angel of death through accident catch them on a way. Let the angel of death through accident catch them on a way. Anybody using your, your, your secret, be your video, be your naked video, any of your past partners, past partners, be your past husband, be your past wife, be your past fiancé, be your past girlfriend or boyfriend that have any video of you, naked video of you, new pictures of you that is planning to release it on the medium to disgrace you in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I assign the angel of death. Let them, let the angel of death push them to their early grave. Yes. Because it is an error. God say even your enemy cover them. It is it, it is an error. God says even your enemy cover their nakedness. When they are naked, cover it. When they are naked, cover it. Anybody preparing that table for you? Anybody planning to disgrace you? Anybody planning to disgrace you? Oh my God, in the name of Jesus, let them visit their every room. Let the angel of death cut them on away. Let the angel of death cut them on away. Let the tender and the vengeance sword of God take them out in their dwelling place, wherever they are, north, south, east, and west, wherever they are, wherever they are. Let the vengeance sword of God let it chase them out. Out. Let it chase them 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 out. The vengeance sword of God, whoever is blackmailing you in the name of Jesus, whoever is using your secret to blackmail you, to blackmail you, to blackmail you, to blackmail, to blackmail. My God, in the name of Jesus, let the angel of death catch them on away. I assign the sword of God, the vengeance sword of God. My God, let it deal with them. In their secret place, in their comfort zone, in their bathroom, in their homes, in the market, I assign the double-edged sword. Let it chase them out. Let it chase them out. Let it chase them out. The double-edged sword. In the name of Jesus Christ, anybody planning to disgrace us, in the name of Jesus, I push you to your every grave. Anybody, let me come again. Our time is almost up. But let me come again. Anybody that have paid money, for a group of people to tarnish your image. Anybody underground, behind, sponsoring people to insult you for no reason. For no reason. Anybody, because they, they hate you. Because they want to bring you down. Because they want to stop you. Because they want to destroy your future. Because they want to kill your destiny. Because they want to silence your destiny. In the name of Jesus Christ. All those underground, sponsoring wickedness against your life. Let the vengeance sword of God chase them out and destroy them. Dismantle them. Tear them. Break them. Break them. Tear them. Dismantle. In the name of Jesus. The double-edged edge sword, the double-edged sword, the double-edged sword, wherever they are, wherever they are, wherever they are, in the name of Jesus, all, the, all those wicked people, that wicked people, paying money for them to kidnap you, kidnap your son, kidnap your daughter, kidnap your husband, kidnap your sibling, in the name of Jesus, let the, the tender of God, I assign the tender, right now, the tender of God, wherever they are, Wherever they gather to take their money, to come and kidnap your son, to come and kidnap your husband, to come and kidnap your wife, to come and kidnap your sibling, anybody that concerns your life, in the name of Jesus, let the tender of God, let it strike them, let it strike them, let it strike them, the tender of God, the tender of God, the tender of God, wherever they are hiding, right now, right now, the tender of God, let it strike, let it strike, let it strike, the lightning, the tender, the lightning, wherever they um, let it strike, 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 Jesus. Enough of this nonsense. Enough of this nonsense. They can't sit in their comfort zone. Use your, your past life, your past relationship, that the relationship that you, you went in. They persuaded you. They didn't tell you we are here to fornicate with you. Oh, we are here to marry you. We are here to marry you. And because of love, for love's sake, people can do anything anyhow. For love's sake, maybe your naked picture is with them. And they are using to torment you, blackmail you. 
If you don't pay this amount, I will release it on the media. Anybody that have altered such a word, we give that person three days to repent. Three days to reverse his ways. As the angel of death will meet them on our way. It is not, I am not joking. No. I don't pray prayers like this. I pray prayers like this based on what I have seen. Sometimes when I'm leading prayers, I get time to tell you what I am seeing. But sometimes I don't just, I just want the Holy Spirit to lead us. That's why I don't just delay to tell what I've been seeing. But this is what I am seeing. One of you, one of you, I lifted this prayer purposely for one of you. Because your life, even you can't think. Somebody is using your, your nude to blackmail you, blackmail blackmail seriously if you don't give me this i will release your nude if you don't give me this i will post the video if you don't give me this i will post the video enough enough we give them three days to repent or else we assign the angel of death to be on straight assignment on them straight assignment on them we give you three days to repent to reverse, to delete everything, every information that you are carrying about us. We give you three days, delete everything, delete everything and pray for forgiveness. Else the angel of death is on, on, on his way coming. The angel of death is around you. And those that are, are on the way coming, they are also coming. Yes. Yes. All the wickedness against our life have to come to an end for us to get a peaceful mind to serve God, for us to get a good heart to serve God, for us to live according to the work of God, the will of God. Let all their plans be destroyed. All the dreams that you have, that it will come to pass within this first week of November. I cancel that demonic dreams. I cancel that evil dreams. All the dreams about death, that is that 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 actual actual date how they read it is on the on the on the first second third fourth fifth sixth seventh of November. I cancel that dream. Every dream in effect, full term, that is about to happen. That is about to happen. Dream about death in the name of Jesus. I cancel it. I wipe away that tears. And I put joy in your heart. The tears, the tears, the tears. Oh, all the cries in your dream. I change it from today. You will never bury any of your relative. No. You never bury your children. Any of your children. I cancel the accident. The accident scene. I cancel it in the name of Jesus. All those that they passed from the past week... You've been having sex in dreams. All those that you've been having sex in dreams, I surround your soul with fire. All those that the agent are still having sex with you. The demons are still having sex with you. The forces are still visiting you in dreams to come and have sex with you. This time around, when they die, you let the tender of God scatter them. Let the fire of God consume them. Let the tender of God scatter them. Let the fire of God consume them. All the spirit wives, all the spirit husbands, in the name of Jesus, I release your arrest. I release your arrest. I release your arrest. I release your arrest. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, all the spirit husband, spirit wives, your day of judgment have come. Pack your things and go. Receive your divorce letters and go. Receive your certificate and go. Right now, in the name of Jesus, pack your things from the life of God's children. In the name of Jesus Christ, pack your things. Anytime you dare to come and have sex with them, anytime you plan to come and come to come and lie, to come and have sexual intercourse with them, in the name of Jesus Christ, I command the tender of God to strike you. The tender and the lightning of Elohim, the tender and the lightning from above. In the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, let it destroy you. All the things that you've scattered all the things that you've destroyed through your last four desires in their life i command you to compensate them 
I force you to compensate them in the realms of the spirit. Compensate them right now in the name of Jesus Christ. All the distractions that through your last devil hear me. Through your lustful desires that you've destroyed, that you break down in the life of God's children, in the name of Jesus, I command you to release the compensation in the realms of the spirit. Release the compensation. Release the compensation in the name of Jesus. Compensate them. Restore their works in the name of Jesus. Restore their handwork that you've destroyed. Restore their finances that you are letting them go through financial difficulties because of your lustful desire. Because of your lustful desire, devil, hear me. Set all the captive free with a compensation. Set all your captives in your custody. Set them free. Release them with a compensation. Release them with a compensation. Release them with a compensation fee. In the name of Jesus Christ, release them. Open the prison gate and set them free. Open the prison gate and set them free. All those that you putting them into prison, the prison of masturbation, I command you set your captive free. The prison of alcoholism, the, the prison of womanizing, in the name of Jesus, I force you, I put heavenly pressure on you. Oh, set them free. Set them free. Set them free. Release them in the name of Jesus. 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 Jesus, I come to you right now, devil, you and your, 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 your company. I come to you right now with fire and tender from above. Wherever you are, I come to you right now in the realm of the spirit with fire and tender, with fire and tender, with fire and tender, with fire and tender, with fire and tender. And, and, and I command you to open that prison gate, 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 release their soul. Set them free. Set all your captive free. Devil, hear me. Set your captive free. Devil, hear me. Set them free. Deliver them. Release them. Release them from that strong drink. Release them from that alcoholic, that power, that lust. Take, 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 take your last full desire. Take it from them and set them free. Set all the captives in your custody. Release them, all those in your prison, all those in your prison because of fornication. Release them, all those in prison. My God, in the name of Jesus, release them with a the compensation. Restore their destiny. Restore their life. Restore their future. Praise them in their rightful seat. All the seed that you've exchanged through your, 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 your ways, that you've diverted their blessings. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, restore your children. As they are moving from here, Father, open the fraud gate of heaven and rain blessings unto their life. Open the fraud gate of heaven, rain breakthroughs into their life. Open the front gate of heaven, my God. Reign victory. Victory over every situation, every case, every issue. Father, open financial doors. Settle your children financially. Grant them financial breakthroughs. Grant them marital freedoms. Grant them, deliver them from sexual bondage, financial bondages. My God, in the name of Jesus Christ, Father, deliver your children. Bless their handwork. Open closed doors. Grant them dominion over thrones, over kingdoms, over territories, over nations. Father, grant your children international platforms, international access, global access. Wherever your children want to go to, let your favor go before them. Let your favor go before them. Father, bless them. I lift all my helpers into your hand. Holy Spirit, you are the God that bless. You are the God that bless Abraham and told Abraham that whoever will bless you, I will bless that person. Whoever will curse you, I will curse that person. Father, in the name of Jesus, release Abrahamic blessings that he offered gifts 
Oh, to the king of Salem, the ancient city of peace, that you release that blessing, release that blessing into the life of all my sponsors. All those that has been sponsoring it from day one, that I started this ministry to now. Father, in the name of Jesus, as you remembered Abraham, through his gifting and his descendant, remember my destiny helpers, my ministry helpers, the titans in this ministry, all those that their tithes have been in this ministry to promote your kingdom work. Father, in the name of Jesus, destroy the devourer from their, their business. Destroy the devourer from their work. Destroy the devourer from their investment. In the name of Jesus Christ, open the floodgate of heaven and rain your blessings as you promised them. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. God bless you all. God bless you all. God willing, tomorrow we are here. Yes, we are here. We are still here. God willing, if, we, if, if Jesus Christ doesn't come and we are still alive, we are still here because the devil, they are still at work. So we are also here every night. God bless you all. If God blesses you and you want to support this ministry, we need your support. Any little amount to give to us to buy bundle, it is not by force. Nobody is forcing anybody. We are not forcing anybody to come and sow seed, to come and pay tight, to come as your own heart, your own will. If this ministry has been a blessing to you and you want to sponsor little to buy data, to buy prepaid because we use prepaid. To buy our prepaid, we will take it and we will bless you all the time. God bless you so much. God bless you so much. If you want to do that, you can just contact me on the WhatsApp. Those of you that you are not in the global platform, you can send me your number. I will add you on the global platform. You don't speak Ghanaian language oh, because people don't know your Ghanaian language. So don't bring the Ghanaian language there. Let me say it. Yes, don't bring it there. <laughs> don't bring it there. Write one language. Use one language that everybody will understand. So that everybody will feel comfortable. Yes, we are all missing globally. It is our global platform. If you want to join it, you can join it. It's so lovely. God bless you. Let's all share the grace. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Oh, one of you, your stomach. Who is that? Stomach pain. I don't know. I don't know. Stomach pain. Let me pray for you. Are you on the main platform? Before we go, if grows, but I want to pray for that person. Stomach. One of you, your stomach. Your stomach. Your stomach. Who is that? Are you on the main broadcast? I don't know. I don't know. Yes. Your stomach. You can't even straighten up. You can't straight. If you're on the main broadcast, let me know. That is you. I release you right now. I release you right now. Or you can call me after the program. You call me on WhatsApp. My WhatsApp number is on top of the video. You call me WhatsApp. God willing, tomorrow we shall meet. Bye-bye.